famous. I made that bitch famous. Shit, dropping some Kanye lines. Let's get in the video. Welcome back to another video, guys. How are you doing today? We're back in Adventure Quest World. I, uh, when's the last time I uploaded my channel? Was it like two days ago? Jeez, dude. Jeez. It's a Monday now. So we got a bunch of news to talk about, a bunch of news I haven't covered already, including a, a new Dage item. Uh, we have a class buff. What else? There's a, there's, a, there's a few more things. Let's get into it. Little news bit is that Paint Style of Eden is making a return. The Evolve Paint Style of Eden. Uh, we got, actually got teased this a long time ago, like before Dage's birthday this year. Uh, so a long time ago, we, we assumed it was going to come out on Dage's birthday. It did not. And it is now uh, been recently bugged and is replacing people's Paint Style of Edens when they were re-logging. Um, I couldn't get this to happen to me, but it happened to a few people on my Twitter timeline. Uh, and they tweeted at me. Thank you for the people who tweeted that at me. That's very cool information to know that this weapon will probably be coming in the game very soon as it was teased a long time ago and is now appearing in people's inventories, uh, replacing the original paint saw. Although I think it'll be a merge item, uh, as we assumed before, that you need the original paint saw and probably some Legion tokens to merge it. So that might be hinting at an upcoming event. Who knows? So let's move on to the next story. All right, our second bit of news today is that the class that recently came out, the Eternal Inversionist class, got a buff to the auto attack for a less mana cost or something like that. I don't actually know what the buff is, but it did get buffed in some certain way. So it will be a bit better than it was before. And uh, yeah, it's showing it off right here. I don't, I don't really, I mean, is it doing more damage? I can't really tell. I'd have to look at the tape on my class guide. So apparently there is definitely more damage and better better the class is just better okay that's what a buff is the, the class is better now guys all right that's the news let's go on to the next story very good news reporter guys all right the next story is the player suggestion shop colors i have showed here we have what well, I, for, I literally forgot what it was called in like three seconds archfiend doom knight coming back it's not coming back coming to the game a color custom quest reward version and a player suggestion shop colors as shown here. So that's non-color custom, it's color custom. Pretty self-explanatory, but that will be coming to the game uh, when the suggestion shop comes, which is later this month sometime, I think around this Friday or next Friday. So we'll see that in the coming weeks. Very cool armor, I like it a lot, and uh, can't wait to have it in the game. Let's move on to the next piece of news. Here is another armor coming very, very soon from Cauldron. Or, how do you say his name, dude? How do you say this guy's name? Is this some D in it? It's not called <laughs> Krulon. 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 I have no clue how to say his name, to be honest. But he's pretty good at uh, the art and stuff. He's a pretty talented artist. So that armor is coming soon. I'll assume on Friday. So, moving on to the next piece. Here is another quick look at some suggestion shop items that are coming to the new suggestion shop. So, I like that katana a lot. That's pretty cool, though. I don't know how how practical having a rope wrapped around your katana is. I'm pretty sure that would lower the DPS a little bit. All right, let's move on to the next thing. It's Monday right now. I don't think these surfboards are in-game, but it says Twig and Twilly surfboards. Very hard to get. Coming to Zuri's Merge Shop on Monday for all players. So it's that surfboard and... Where's the other one? That one. So very cool-looking surfboards. And I definitely want, that one's pretty cool. I like both of them actually, but apparently they're very hard to get and they're supposed to be here Monday, although I've heard nothing about them and it's 6.30 at night. So I don't think they'll be here. Maybe they'll be here tomorrow. Once they're in the game, I'll definitely make a video about it. But this is supposed to be in the game right now. It might be, you can go check out, um, what is it, Zuri's Merch Shop. You can go check that out. That's part of the Throne of Darkness saga, if you do not know already. Let's move on to the next story last piece of news i'm gonna leave you guys with definitely the least interesting you know save the worst for last but it is a look at the next week's event this friday's event is that a pikachu is 
got a Pikachu. Oh my god. Okay, so I can't wait for the next week's event. Looks pretty cool, actually. I'm sure the story will be great on it, and hopefully have some good gear. Although I did show some gear that looks like it's part of this event earlier in this episode, so maybe that we'll see that gear also. Thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully I see you in the next video, guys. That will be up on my channel tomorrow. Have a great week, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Let's see if we can hit 100 likes on this video. Peace. Click the video in the top right corner if you haven't seen it yet, and I'll see you all in the next one.